You're on. Okay. Hello, everybody. Now we make a little video of one of our boas. She is a leopard. Leopard possible head. Uh, albino. Call albino. She is uh, a little squirmy right now. She's a nice girl. Her pattern is, for what is there of her pattern, is pretty nice. It's kind of like it blacks out on her, blacks out, blanks out, disappears. She's got a very nice, uh, what do you call that? Uh, mm, shimmery hues, I can't remember. Kind of like but, an oil spill? Yeah, uh, kind of like an oil spill. Very nice young lady here. The leopard leopard genetics are from a lower, not lower, smaller, smaller, smaller type boa. So, she is three years old, and she eats all the time. Just doesn't grow. She's really squirmy. Yeah, she's really squirmy today. But uh, this is her. We thought we'd show you her. She does not have a name. Can, does that shimmer you? A little bit. Ir, iridescence. Does that come in there? A little bit. Does it? Out in the sunlight, it comes in a lot better. Those LED lights just a little bit, but but very pretty girl here. We will be breeding her next year, not this year. And the male we have for her is a hypo leopard possible albino and this year he is breeding to an albino jungle so hopefully we can prove out if he's albino or head albino I mean but this year she gets another year to grow before meeting her boyfriend so anyway that's her get her head? Yeah. Oh. Alright. We were going to show you our... Uh, we'll eventually get the other one out. But she is... Was sold to me as a... Blood Red Hypo. Or Blood Red Super Hypo. Anyway. It was just a real pretty snake. The guy had no idea on the actual genetics. But she's real pretty. But anyway, this is the leopard, possible albino, boa constrictor. And I don't think she'll get much bigger than this. So, anyway, comment. Let me know what you think of this gal. Give it a like, share it, subscribe.